What's happening everybody? Furious Pete here and today I got a cigar hack for you. That's right, not everybody has these cigar cutters with them at all times. Let's say you're on the golf course and you need to smoke a cigar with your buddies but you don't have a cutter. And you don't want to just bite off the end because that's really, really bad because then you get pieces everywhere. And you don't want to just cut it off with a knife because, again, you'll get cigar pieces everywhere. So, like, you take a cigar and let's say you cut that off with a knife and you can still get those bits and everything into your mouth. And that is just the worst thing ever. Also, in Cuba, when I was there, um, I basically, I learned, this is the hack that I learned. So I'm going to play that for you quickly from a Cuban that, that taught me this. This is a cigar hack. You would never see this ever. Cigar hack 101. Just stick something in there. It's like a penis. Yeah, you just take out the excess tobacco. As you can see, he uh, he is making a hole in the cigar. Rather than cutting it, he's making a hole. So what you can do, uh, obviously, the the type of instrument that you're using for the hole has to vary uh, according to the actual thickness of the cigar. Obviously, if the cigar is this thickness, you can't use something that is almost the same thickness, otherwise you are going to destroy the cigar. Uh, what I also learned within Cuba is that, you know, people really really appreciate the cigar and the tobacco leaves going into it and the whole process going into it so you really got to make sure that you are preserving it so what I'm gonna do is take this cigar and take a golf tee um, basically let's say you are on the golf course and you don't have cutters but you have yourself a golf tee and so what you can do is just get into the middle right here and start making a hole you go in deep just like so, right? And that's it. And now you have a hole. You can go really pretty deep here. And now you have a hole ready for smoking. Now I would light it up, but I, um, I don't know if you can I don't know, you guys probably can't hear it, but there is very good ventilation going through right now. Uh, obviously, that also depends on the kind of cigar. So, you can just put that hole into it, right there. Just like so. And that's all you need. You don't have to cut it all off. It's still going to work just fine if... Uh, if you make a hole like this. It's going to work very, very well. You're not going to have bits and pieces go into your mouth. You're not going to waste any cigar whatsoever. Uh, this cigar is ready to be smoked, ready to be enjoyed. Just a little hack that I learned when I was in Cuba. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this hack next time you are out with your buddies and you intend on having a cigar. Use this hack if you don't have a cutter. And even if you do have a cutter, use this hack anyways. Catch you guys next time. Furious Pete, like up this video, subscribe, stay sexy, stay hungry, and of course, get laid, my friends. Should I do cardio before or after? Now, the, the answer is quite simple, after. Um, however, a lot of people will argue that. Um, I will never argue that.